Marijuana is one of the psychoactive drugs which can distort perception and alter brain chemistry. It is produced from a flowering hemp, a weed-like plant given the botanical name of Cannabis sativa. Cannabis plants contain more than 60 unique compounds that are collectively known as cannabinoids. The psychoactive properties of these cannabinoids is a substance known as tetrahydrocannabinol or THC. The brain synthesizes its own cannabinoid known as anandamide. This neurotransmitter regulates hunger, sleeping and the management of pain relief. In high quantities, this neurotransmitter can be associated with preventing epilepsy as well as regulating immune responses. It has been shown to reduce the rapid division of breast cancer cells. THC mimics the effects of anandamide and depending on the amount of THC consumed, its effects can be at a much larger scale. THC acts on excitatory pyramidal neurons which are found in areas of the brain including the cerebral cortex and the hippocampus. Marijuana acts at the cannabinoid receptors of the presynaptic membrane. It stops the influx of calcium ions entering the neuron, therefore it stops the release of the inhibitory neurotransmitter called GABA. This results in constant firing of the pyramidal neurons, which is why certain thoughts and ideas can be magnified to a large scale and given a profound meaning when on the drug. A person can get lost in this train of thought along with any sense of time. The drug can be separated into six stages. The high, euphoria, the self-reflection stage, paranoia, the munchies and finally the fading stage. The high stage consists of a light buzz coupled with random laughter and a tingling sensation at the extremities. The euphoria stage sends a person into a deep sense of relaxation and happiness. During the latter end of the stage and the beginning of the next stage, which is the self-reflection stage, a great level of contemplation may take place where you begin to question life, its purpose, the endless universe and the worried nature of reality. Not everyone may experience this next stage, but paranoia can affect some. It does depend on one's personality, mood and social settings. The stimulation of the CB1 cannabinoid receptor can significantly increase the person's appetite, which is the stage known as the munchies. The fade away stage is the final stage where the effects of the drug begins to wear off, with the person often left fatigued and wanting to sleep. Marijuana can affect a person's social state. Depending on the person's social tendencies, a person can have an increased desire to be with others or either distance themselves from everyone and may feel alone and secluded. This type of social withdrawal can be exacerbated with chronic use. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.